In this year's EZOC, we had over 2,300 abstracts were submitted. So abstract submission is now quite competitive. And, and I think most people, when they submit an abstract, would like it to be in an, in an oral presentation and, and, and to have an oral platform. And in order to do that, it's very important that you make sure your abstract stands out from, from the others. The abstract reviewers do a tremendous job. They have a very hard job. Many of them will review over 100 abstracts. So your abstract really needs to sell the message. Think of yourself as, as, as a salesman. You need to sell the concept. What's the clinical question? What's the clinical uncertainty that I'm trying to address? How am I addressing that clinical uncertainty? What's the methodology? What's the headline data? What's the headline message, the main result? and then a rational and balanced conclusion that leaves the, the abstract reviewer with a very clear understanding of why things were done, what they found, and what the importance of it is.